Hello guys, welcome to another time out with me on the channel. My name is Alec Godwin if you're meeting me for the first time. And today, it's in my black magic again. They've done it this time. Like, yeah, it's something we're talking about. And I know many people may not see this as something really big, but I'm gonna break it down for you. Why this might be your next camera. This might be the cinema camera you've been waiting for. Ready? All right, if you're here for the first time, I would love for you to subscribe to the channel because here we do um, music movies, tech reviews, short films, feature films, documentary, the whole nine. Basically, if you like to watch movies or learn how to make movies, then this is the channel for you. So you might want to subscribe to the channel right now because actually, actually, we have three giveaways for 3,000 subscribers, probably less than 40 subscribers away. That can happen anytime, so please subscribe. Now, back to why we are here. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, it may not be obvious, but this is a real good camera we are looking at for a very good price. I'll just go ahead and talk about the specs, um, well, the major specs that I'm concerned with, um, that I think most people will like to hear about in order to consider this camera. And um, hopefully it helps you know if this is the camera for you. Don't forget, it's already shipping. Black Magic, they're always ready for action. So it's already um, shipping right now. But first, is it the one for you? Number one, they say it's three in one, but it's pretty much the same thing as the previous. Right now, the three in one is more realistic. So what are the three things? Um, number one, it's a production camera. Two, it's a studio camera. And three, it's a digital, like a film camera, which you can use in Hollywood. Now, the previous was already, like you know, it's the previous uh, broadcast was already Netflix approved. In other words, you could use it for TV and film. It has Blackmagic Raw. The number two thing, which is like the bomb right now, is that this camera has a 6k sensor that is a way larger resolution than the also mini pro g2 4.6k right uh, which is still the highest uh black magic camera in terms of uh, dynamic range but but i will argue something now and that will take me to number three feature on this camera which is 13 stops of dynamic range now the ceo of black magic he said um which is a, a lot higher than the previous i never knew what the, the dynamic range was but i assume it was 12 which which also brought good results so this is 13 and you might say 13 is low uh, but here's my argument black magic has a new sensor uh, which only the 12k has until now so this is the first camera besides the 12k that is enjoying this new sensor and it's coming natively with with the g5 color signs i believe this the 13 stops will still blow your mind if anybody um has the 12k who was a previous owner of the 4.6k uh, or you still have both we would love to see like a comparison in my opinion from the little reviews I've seen, which has never been a clear comparison, but just um, making my own comparison from the footages and the reviews I've seen of both units, I think they are about the same quality. You know, with the added advantage to the 12K of the resolution. Okay, so I think this color science, this sensor catches up maybe even better. I don't know i'm not saying but i'm just i'm just trying to tell you that um not to look down on the 13 stops of dynamic range here's the next thing it is cheaper it is cheaper than the ursa mini pro g2 once again so if you really don't need 12k i mean 
for me, the why the smart move will be if you have the money, go for the 12k. You've got broadcast dreams, it will be smart to go for this camera, you know, because it's really three in one. It is a better camera to go into a movie like I'm planning. Um, uh, than with the 6k pro i don't know if you understand me hey if you want to rig up the 6k pro you probably <laughs> with the rig you know and everything you probably end up at pay, paying the same amount as this uh, broadcast camera it comes with double c fast card double sd card and it can record external um, ssd same thing like the ursa it is remember the name ursa broadcast uh, g2 okay so it has the ursa parts you can swap up the ursa battery the top handle you know basic accessories are, will be the same so that's a plus yeah. so it's, this is this is the this is the bomb for me okay if okay check this out if if everybody almost all the reviews out there have already um clarified that the sys cape the 6k black magic pocket 6k which is the same thing as 6k pro um have i mean 99 percent of the reviews have established that the black magic has better images than um the uh, a7s3 fs6 okay because pretty much the a7s3 is the same thing as the fs6 now the fs6 is about six thousand maybe over i'll write it on the screen when uh, to be sure remember the sys uh, fs6 is a 4k sensor full frame i know but it's a 4k sensor this broadcast camera trust me it's a much it's a it's a better buy in my opinion it's a much better buy than that camera you only have the ad the advantage of well, full frame and autofocus, which is not a big deal for professionals if you are. Anyway, it's a positive if you have it, but it's not that a big deal if you don't have it. The R5, I know there are 8K cameras out there. R5, there's, there's 6K, um, um, I think another 8K from Sony. They are all DSLR-like, you know, they are really not production cameras um, officially, even though they can be used in that capacity they are not actual production camera now this is a production camera something new that wasn't in the previous uh, version is h264 and h265 recordings i think there are there are flavors of it of them for flexibility and uh, speed um h265 is now on board okay so that's new then um in this package so when if you go for this camera, you will find the EF lenses in there, which I don't know if they did it before, but I'm I love the fact that it is included. You know, a lot of people are going to be getting this camera as a production camera. Pe people who don't even have a broadcast dreams will probably buy this camera just like I am thinking. You know, honestly, I am thinking. That's why we are sh talking today. I will look into the comment and hear your feedback before I can decide to. While I'm telling you this thing, I'm just running it um, the way it's in my head, you know, like the way it strikes me uh, so that you guys can react to it. And I'll be watching your reactions in the comments below so I can make my own decision as well. It's just for us to decide. Like, subscribe. Don't forget the giveaway coming soon. Immediately after that giveaway, trust me, there's another giveaway immediately and it's going to be the biggest giveaway ever on youtube i said it thank you guys for watching like subscribe see you in the next one. peace